excited I had to see it for myself. <laughs> He's cute. You see, I, uh, wanted to warn you. Warn us, sir? Yes. Now, I'm not sure if you've heard, but it's come to my attention that there are some very disreputable people around. And I'm concerned that these people, these terrorists, well, they might take advantage of your hospitality. Maybe ruin your wonderful reputation. And we wouldn't want that to happen now, would we? No, sir. No. Well, would you allow me to protect you? To ensure your reputation? Please, yes, Kingman. Your wish is my command. <laughs> I'm so glad we could agree on this. Well, I won't take up any more of your time. Uh, this should only take a moment. And they say I've lost touch with my subjects. No! They'll kill you! I'm getting pagan. I found Pagan! I'm on his heels! I think you could end it right now! I know!
plates, yes, you did. Hagen? I just killed you! No, no, you just ruined a perfectly good body double with hair loss. Do you know how expensive he was to make? He wasn't even Asian, for Christ's sake. He was from Melbourne, I think. His only crime was being born with fabulous cheekbones. Whose picture do you think's on the money? No matter what's done is done, I suppose next time it'll just be you and me. Megan? I just killed you! No, no, you just ruined a perfectly good body double with- I did. I'm hurt. <laughs> you don't recognize my voice? Should I? The voice of Radio Freaky Rot? This is Rabbi Ray Rana! You don't- you don't recognize that? Right. Robbie Ray Rana. Just call me Rabbi Ray, man. Okay, Robbie Ray. What's this about? Look, we need a face-to-face. -face. I'm sending you my coordinates. Come find me, man.
Ajay, you're just in time. Pagan's broadcast is starting. What's this about? No clue, brother. But we're going to find out. Good people of Kirat. I'm sure you will all be delighted to know that the reports of my death are completely and utterly inaccurate. I am alive, and all is right in the world. The life brings change, and I implore you, Kirat, to look to my example and see it as the positive influence it is. Change requires strength, and it is a strength that I know all of you possess. Now, I recently experienced change within my own organization. Miss Knorr and Paul Deplore, after years of dedicated service, have decided to move on. I'm sure you will all join me in wishing them well in their future endeavors. But like them, we must look forward, not back. The attempt on my life is nothing more than a symptom of resistance to change. Rest easy. For Yuma Lao, my trusted commander-in-chief, who oversees our mining operations at the KEO facility, stands between me and any would-be assassin. She would rather die than see any harm come to me. Go ahead, I challenge you. Put her resolve to the test. To summarize, change is good. Embrace it. Your king is alive. Rejoice. And Yuma stands like a sentinel, waiting. Bring it on. Sounds like he's calling us out. The mines. You know what to do. I've spent a lot of my life apologizing for Yuma's first impressions. She has a remarkable ability to make consistently 